In Indonesia, Bunakin National Park has been a marine protected area since 1991. The coral reefs are healthy, reef fish abound, and the park has become a turtle superhighway. 30 years ago, they were absent on the reefs. On this dive, I wanted to capture images of these iconic turtles to share their success story. Often, I shoot photos and videos on the same dive, which requires two different mindsets. Plus, I need cooperative subjects. Not all the animals like to become movie stars. I even talk to the animals, hoping they'll cooperate. Lucky for me, this perfect turtle smiled at my camera and then slowly started swimming from its resting place. followed along, completely focused, thinking about all the different camera angles I needed to capture to tell a story. But in a moment, everything changed as I let this beauty swim out of frame. I noticed plastic fishing line coming out of its bottom. I pulled gently as I filmed, hoping I could just pull it all out. I knew I had to document this, but I could only pull so hard because there was something stuck inside which felt like a hook. I didn't want to hurt my friend. The turtle knew I was helping it because he hovered while I helped him. All I could do was cut the line. Tears welled in my eyes. Although we create marine protected areas where animals can thrive, we still can't protect them from people and our pollution. We are better than this as a society. We must stop the flow of pollution and plastics into our ocean. We're lucky Helen and her kids clean up their beach. They want everyone to stop treating our ocean as a trash can. We need your help because everything we do on land affects the ocean. Think big. What can you do to help stop the flow of pollution into the sea?